Christmas took an unexpected turn for the family who lost their five-year-old in a drive-by shooting this year. In an effort to bring them some joy this holiday season, Santa came two days early. Our Kristen Volk was there for the delivery today, and Kristen, quite an effort out there. Quite an effort, Frank, and it was quite a sight as more than a dozen of Santa's helpers arrived at their apartment this afternoon, and suddenly a little bit of heartache replaced with happiness. To see everyone showing that they care. Thank you. A mom who lost so much, surrounded by so many people, so many presents today. But this really represents life after tragedy. And life for Rachel Burnett has been nothing short of a struggle since September. My baby was a happy child. He was. He loved. Everyone loved him. Her child was five-year-old Ramon Burnett, fatally shot in a drive-by shooting outside of his home here on Cleveland's Near East Side. He was playing football with friends. His brother asks for him every day, and it's like I don't know what to tell him. Uh, whatever you need, if we can help you, I want you to continue to reach out to me. Their family, no doubt broken, but their spirits lifted today with the help of Cleveland's Clerk of Courts, Earl Turner, and his staff, plus Cleveland police and members of the Prince Hall Masonry. Together, they brought dozens of gifts for the family, building blocks, stuffed animals, Barbies. This case, I'm just so excited right now. We just have so much to give them today so they can have a wonderful Christmas. All of this coupled with Rachel's most cherished Christmas gift, her newborn baby boy. Her smile says it all. I don't know what to say, but I am overwhelmed to see all of this and everyone that cares. Four men have been charged in Burnett's murder, and Cleveland police tell me today that they are donating items to other families who lost children due to gun violence this year. Live in Cleveland, I'm Kristen Volk, News Channel 5.